Unless you have been living under a rock, you would know that NFTs are taking the world by storm. Previously, it was assumed that NFTs are for the select cyber crowd. But recently, with news about the incredible prices at which NFTs are selling, we have hordes of people jumping on the NFT bandwagon. NFTs are quickly capturing the public minds and fueling their imaginations. So, are NFTs the future or just a hyped up trend? Let's explore it here. NFTs are the future because it is about decentralizing commerce and increasing transparencies. NFTs are going to play a key role in allowing greater freedom for people to engage in peer-to-peer -peer trade. NFTs can eliminate dependencies on intermediaries allowing artists and creators to be more innovative and better compensated. Some of the news we are hearing are definitely evidence that NFTs are gaining immense traction. Beeple recently sold an NFT for a whopping $69 million. Genesis Estate sold a virtual plot for $1.5 million on the gaming platform Axie Infinity. These kinds of transactions have brought it into the limelight of public thought. Huge number of people are getting onto NFT marketplaces and creating NFTs and trading in them. Here is a primer on NFTs for the newly initiated. NFTs are digital certificates that are used to verify ownership of a virtual asset, which allows it to be transferred or sold to anyone else. It is based upon the blockchain technology, which is a transparent transaction ledger that is recording transactions over multiple networks to ensure that there is no tampering or manipulating of ownership records. The blockchain system is fail-safe and hence vital use when it comes to crypto. How do NFTs work? NFTs are digital certificates that allow a person to claim ownership and establish the authenticity of a digital asset. This allows the owners of these assets to sell or transfer them with ease as the authenticity is verifiable by anyone. The buyer can have full knowledge and personally verify ownership before buying. It is a total win-win for the buyer and seller. What underlies this is the same blockchain technology that makes cryptocurrency possible. Essentially, blockchain is an encrypted block of code which records all transactions and it is replicated across networks of machines. This ensures that there is no tampering or manipulation or an undoing of claims of ownership. So why are people paying top dollar to buy NFTs? NBA Top Shot sales of NBA player highlights and trading cards as well as digital work in the company has generated millions of dollars. Websites like CryptoKitties allow users to buy digital cats and grow them on the blockchain. These digital kitties have been sold for more than $150,000. Why are the prices so high? Most experts think that rather than the enthusiasm of acquiring collectibles, the surge in NFTs driven by speculation and money. Others believe that this is the beginning of the boom and NFTs are the way forward. This can also be attributed to the increasing accessibility and platform that have sprouted up recently. Some of the marketplaces that are riding this wave include OpenSea, Rarible, as well as Nifty Gateway to name a few. The creation of NFTs have multiplied and have become more innovative as well. Now you can sell digital cards, music, virtual land, game characters, artwork, select moments and anything that can be created as a digital collectible. Marketplaces have multiplied in number two. Tons of marketplaces accept Ethereum, but an NFT can be bought in any currency. How are NFTs being used today? Popular music producer 3 Lau amassed $11.6 million on an NFT auction around his latest album. The top bidder received a custom song created by 3 Lau, an NFT for each track on the album, unreleased music, and even a physical copy on vinyl. NBA Top Shot sells NBA player highlights, trading cards, digital artwork, and more. Customers have generated the company over $330 million as of early 2021. With highlight reels of LeBron James going for nearly $200,000. The famous crypto collectible game, Crypto Kitties, allows users to buy unique digital cats and breed them on the blockchain. 
one of the most expensive crypto kit is ever sold was worth approximately $170,000. What are some of the risks with an NFT? NFTs are tradable tokens that can be thought of as bragging rights. They do not transfer copyright ownership of the digital piece you are purchasing. Like anything, with money comes scams. You need to be very careful of purchasing an NFT to verify the origin of the NFT. The technology is new, and it might be difficult to validate the digital signature is valid. If you asked CyberWho to validate the authenticity of a Picasso painting in the physical world, we'd have to call an art expert of the highest order. The same might be true of NFTs. NFTs are also highly speculative. You do not own the copyright of the NFT. Even the artwork sold at Christie's for $68M did not transfer copyright ownership rights from the artist Beeples to the NFT token holder. The only value an NFT holds is in the eyes of the person you're selling it to and what they are willing to spend for it. With speculation comes volatility. Many cryptocurrencies are created each month and some experience a brief meteoric rise as the next Bitcoin replacement digital currency only to come plummeting back down to earth worthless and spent. With that volatility, you could lose a good deal of your investment overnight, so be careful and wary. Can NFTs go bad? NFTs are not as fragile as physical collectibles but there could be issues that may crop up. These issues come with any digital product. Some issues which may cause NFTs to go bad are Image formats of file formats getting corrupted Websites where you store them and could go down You may forget the access passwords to websites and NFTs The cryptocurrency used to create and sell the NFT may cease to exist These are things that can be sorted out with better systems and technological advances NFTs and the future of art NFTs have opened up a great opportunity for artists, as finally artists can have more control over the work they produce without having to depend on corporate forces or intermediaries. The artists can connect with customers and sell their work directly to their customer. NFTs also eradicated the bane of plagiarism and wanton copying brought on by the Internet. This is a huge benefit for the artist who originally created the NFTs and innovation for future. Due to NFTs, a whole new dimension of creativity and innovation has emerged and this not just limited to gaming and art. Some types of innovation in this space include moving beyond static cards into role-playing games and story-driven missions in which connect characters. New types of NFTs and digital assets are being created as we speak. For example, the first tweet ever was posted for sale by Jack Dorsey. On a slightly grosser scale, there is news that William Shatner put X-rays of his teeth as NFTs. NFTs are also proving to be useful in combating counterfeiting of asset. Transactions have been made efficient via the use of smart contracts. NFTs and the future of commerce. Here is why I think NFTs will pave the future of commerce. Business in the current sense is largely monopolistic with a few big players. Rules and regulations support big businesses rather than the smaller businesses or the customer. Blockchain-based systems will disrupt this monopoly and look to creating a new decentralized commerce platform. In turn, this will pave the way for greater innovation and more transparency. The boom that is being seen in 2021 in the NFT seen as a predictor of things to come. The future of e-commerce is mostly decentralized commerce which can lead to NFTs having a major impact in the new era. Currently companies like Amazon and Alibaba control the e-commerce retail market and they are extending into other areas as well. They wield a monopoly in the e-commerce space. NTFs can lead to the elimination of such e-commerce intermediaries. The transactions will be peer-to-peer -peer and customers can directly trade hence putting power back in their hands. Recently, the buyer of Beeple Art, Metacoven has divided the NFTs into smaller size and sold them to others. This is type of trade is new and it is not really clear if it is legal, as laws have not caught with NFTs yet. 
NFT are in a state of rapid evolution now. In the future, it is possible that the concept of NFTs can be modified and improved so that more and more users can easily get on such platforms to conduct trade. Major issue that is facing the energy and blockchain network is the use of huge amounts of energy to complete transactions. This in turn can have a horrible effect on the carbon footprint and omission of green gases. Using better technologies and shift to better paradigms should handle most of these issues. We need to see how NFTs will evolve and watch for the possible permutations that can occur. But the way forward is definitely clear. We need to establish a new digitally transparent and accessible system of commerce. Cryptocurrencies and NFTs supported by blockchain certainly fits the bill. With public interest now ignited, it is only a matter for a few years before these become mainstream. Conclusion NFTs have paved the way for a new type of commerce where it is easier for people to trust their seller. There is no need for intermediate parties and so there is no need for any arbitration because of transparent and fail-safe blockchain technology. So once the excitement and the hype settles, newer models and eco-friendly systems are devised, then NFTs will prove to be the way forward. Whoever is reluctant to participate in this change may be soon left behind.